On May 18th, President Barack Obama announced a ban on providing some military equipment to police departments. The changes, which are already in effect, no longer allow the government to give local law enforcement armored vehicles, grenade launchers, and bayonets. Other equipment, like explosives and riot gear, will still be sent to police, but only with additional certification and a promise that the gear will be used responsibly. The changes were made after a White House task force released a report saying there is substantial risk of misusing or overusing these items, which are seen as militaristic in nature, and that police use of military equipment could significantly undermine community trust. Similarly, Obama explained his own reasoning for the change, saying, We've seen how militarized gear can sometimes give people the feeling like there's an occupying force as opposed to a force as part of the community. We're going to prohibit some equipment made for the battlefield that is not appropriate for local police departments. Earlier in May, the Justice Department also announced a $20 million grant program for increasing body camera use by police. Obama hopes these changes will help increase accountability and trust between police and communities.